off. I don't mind that you record it all. Totally your right, right? I do need you to stand over there uh, just a little bit. I'm gonna stand where I wanna stand. Okay, well this is our scene, right? Well, I'm not in your scene. Why don't you just walk away? I'm not in your scene. Thank you, sir. Appreciate that. Hey guys, Patriot First Audit is back with another set of videos that demonstrate First Amendment auditors properly exercising their rights in public. Check the description for links to today's videos, and please remember to subscribe and help support this channel. Let's get right into today's videos. All right, guys, today's video comes from Utah Cop Watch. Um, there's another video that featured him. He's a really great auditor. Um, check a link to his channel in the description. Today's video just comes, these cops are fairly nice to him. They, they don't tell him to go away. They don't really harass him. But what they do is they throw out a bunch of misinformation that is not correct, not accurate. They're clearly not trained on how to uphold the Constitution. So let's check out today's video. It's unbelievable. It doesn't seem like um, I'm in Salt Lake City recording cops. But so far, it seems like the cops during the daytime are cool compared to the ones at nighttime. I don't mind that you record it all. Totally your right, right? But I do need you to stand over there uh, just a little bit. I'm gonna stand where I wanna stand. Okay, well this is our scene, right? Well, I'm not in your scene. Why don't you just walk away? I'm not in your scene. Thank you, sir. Appreciate that. Just don't record the computer. Can I get your name really quick? Officer Carlos. Thank you, appreciate that. All, all that I ask is that you don't record the computer. Don't worry about it. I, I know what I what I can and can do. Okay. Yeah. Thank you. Good job. Great job this officer did. So to the mill on. Standing in public sidewalk. Totally different officers during the daytime here in Salt Lake City. The ones at nighttime, shit. They can't see a camera because they started uh, blinding it with the cam uh, with the flashlight or the spotlight. Were you trying to get oh my no, I'm talking to. Oh, the, the, I, <laughs> I thought you were trying to get my attention, and I didn't want to ignore you. So yeah, was, no, 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 I was talking. No. To you. <laughs> Thanks, man. Um, see, that's a great attitude. And you need to back up. You're gonna get arrested, there, buddy. Back up. You're too close. 1700 South and Main Street, I believe. Yeah, Main Street and 1700 South. Look, a new officer with an attitude. Try to get his name. Are you an FTO? 
I do give the FTO officer Carlson credit for stopping that officer. I have been recording cops for years, and I have never had a supervisor, let alone an officer step up and do what he did. What they will always do is join in and flex their badge and big ego. Nice, nice job. Nice job. I really appreciate what you just did. It, it, I mean, it shows a lot, you know. You know, we, we get a lot that, that talk to like talk to like, people yeah. and things like that. And that's when it's like, okay, you can record, but don't talk to the people that right. we're dealing with. Even that. though, even though um, it's not against the law to do it. It's a freedom of speech, yeah. you know. Yeah. And it's not, and it's not interference because interference is a physical act. It's not words. It, it depends you what know? you're telling them. That can so like you could tell, you could tell someone, let them know about their rights. That's not interference, you know what I mean? So. So it, just as long as though, as you're not delaying the stop, and so, and that's where a lot, a lot of things happen is when guys get frustrated because they're just real simple thing trying to talk to this person, and now this person, because like that sign right there, mm -hmm. uh, the company ha has signed an affidavit with us saying okay. that. If we see people just sitting here, we can roll up and talk to them about trespassing. Okay. And so um, they ha don't have to call us because they've already signed the affidavit. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And so we just roll up, make sure that they're all right. And if there are no issues, boom, they're on their way. Yeah. Um, when they start arguing, that kind of delays the things. of like, well, look, we have reason to stop you. We have reason to be here. Uh, with arguments, that's just delaying everything right. when this could have been a real simple thing right right like i said you, I, I, you, I just, stood, you just stood here you just recorded you didn't say nothing you didn't interfere anywhere and i I'm never just, do i never do i, I mean, never I ain't do. got no problem every now. time something every time that i'm always recording especially here in salt lake city i'm mostly at nighttime mm -hmm. every time that i that i have a problem with an officer is something like this i'm just standing there someone comes up one officer comes up to me it, try to stop me or try to tell me to go over there or I, try to flash like, the light like the on only me. thing that i would like the only thing that i said just make sure you're not recording the computer because that has personal information on it other than that i i, 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 I understand yeah. about that oh, you no, know but a private it. but um like just to let you know like if I wanted to, if anyone wants to, they could record that screen. It is up to you guys to protect that that private that private information. It's up to you guys to protect that that private that private information. It's what it's what I do with that information. If he's typing on that screen and so it's where he can see it and you zoom in to record on it, that's you overstepping your bounds. Right? Yeah, I understand yeah. in your right. feelings, but in by law, it's not. Okay. By law, it's not. If but you know what? But it, it's what I do. Yeah. It's what I do with that information. Right. It's, what's the, it's what I'm breaking the law. Name? Jose. Jose. Yeah. Nice to meet you, Jose. Nice to meet you. My name's Colby. Colby? Hey, yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah. All day long. So, check it out. So, you know what uh, expectation of privacy is, right? Expectation of privacy. There's no such thing as expectation of privacy. It's called reasonable expectation of privacy. If there wasn't, then we can in public. There's no expectation of privacy. So, so the fun, the the crazy thing is, is that right there, because we are working and we've got our computer turned to just us, there is an expectation of privacy. Not for us. It's not our information. It's for the person that we're dealing with. Yeah. So if you violate that, technically you're in violation of that. I wish I, I could get arrested for that. Well, we, and it will never, it will never fly in court. But all I'm never saying is, never fly in court. Jose, Jose, all day long you can record us. Yeah. If you do something like that, and an officer can, like tells you to back off, I would. I, uh, I just would. You know what? And then if and then I you, record, you can research if it. I record something like that, because I have done it, yeah. it does not fly in court. The judge throws it out, and guess what? Just by that, okay. just by that, that little well, thing that you guys, that we'll officer just, did. Then we'll just there's have to a lawsuit. To disagree, man. There's and, a lawsuit but, right there. Uh, and honestly, we appreciate you being there because it's because it's one more camera that shows the whole situation going right. on. So we appreciate you being there because we can see from a third person, not not just us. <laughs> and so, absolutely. Actually, thank you for being here today. I oh, appreciate that, Jose. Yeah. You have a fantastic day. Yeah, you day, too. Okay? You guys stay safe out there. Like yeah, there's a lot of things that that officer is not making sense. There's no such thing of privacy. and But, you know, can't argue with them because they're always right and we're wrong. I mean, I wish they try to arrest me. I wish they arrest me for recording the screen. We all know there's no such thing as expectation of privacy in public. No. All right, guys, there you go. There you have it. 
Utah Cop Watch. Check out his channel. Link in the description. Um, these officers don't know what the hell they're talking about. They're obviously had some sort of First Amendment auditor training, but in all the wrong ways because they're saying that you can't film that screen. There's privacy in public. Um, they didn't really try to violate any of his rights. Um, they did tell him to try. I guess you could say they tried to violate his First Amendment right, but they didn't press the matter. They've obviously gotten some training on what not to do with these auditors um, and just the public in general. So thankfully, he wasn't harassed too badly. But check out his channel. There's a link in the description. And we'll catch you on the next video. Peace.